I mean, I'm a huge fan of all these actresses. So it was such a privilege <laughs> to come to work every day and watch them work. Like some scenes were so intense yeah. and you were really yes. like, rooting for each other, not just the character, but as actresses and their performances. And yeah, it was a real honor to watch um, some of the scenes, especially in the later episodes. But more of a slapstick kind of element. There's, there's plenty of comedy in this show because the premise is, is just inherently funny to see how people, how, how what people decide yeah. when they're watching it. I, I'm interested to see at what point they come on board and, and, and if they stay on board and, and, and uh, you know, I mean, it's it's kind of up to you guys. It's up to the, to the viewers. there's so much fun in watching Marley and Biggie's characters though. You know, I think that's where all the, the juicy fun yeah. and enjoyment that comes uh, you know, alive in the show. And I think I'd be really surprised, but listen, who, who knows, but if people don't just respond to, to, to that, you know, I, I don't, I would be more surprised if they had any sort of issue with that. Yeah. You know, I, th I think that, that's where a lot of the comedy lies. Hi, this is Divya from CNN News 18 from India. So good to see this energy, not only off screen, but of course on screen. <laughs> Absolutely love the series, Bad Sisters. Oh. Thank you for giving us that. You're welcome. Great. Thank you. Yes, yes. And... Sharon, I'll begin with you. You've uh, you've sort of written, created. You're also part. Of, I mean, you you act in Bad Sisters. Is the burden then too much uh, with every project, especially when you're regarded as one of the best TV makers? Uh, uh, <laughs> it is a big burden being one of the best. Uh, uh, no, it's all. It's always you start anything. Um, you feel. Um, yeah, you just feel instant sort of worry about it not being as good as the thing you, you did before. And, um, you know, at this point with two weeks to go before it comes out, you feel extra uh, stressed and wondering what everyone's thinking. And and I, and I, I think I feel a bit extra this time because... It, it's different from what I've done before. I've, I, you know, I've not, I haven't done hours before. You know, I haven't done a thriller before. So, um, yeah, it's it's. Uh, Without sounding ungrateful, it's a huge burden. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And, you know, we all know that stories about morally ambiguous uh, women are very few. And more so when it comes to Irish media. So what, uh, how, how will Bad Sisters um, sort of set a precedent or what sort of message uh, do you expect the series to put forth? I don't know. I feel like there's all sorts of um, things that can be um, taken away. I mean, it's a threat, clearly. It's a very unveiled uh, threat. Um, I don't know. I mean, there is, you know, I mean, it's it's about family. Um, it, it, it's about someone coming along and, and, and messing with your family. And, and what would you do um, if that happened? And how far will you go to um, protect the people you love and just because they are you know attempting to uh to murder a man but um they they've all been pushed to the to the nth degree um by him and 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 his actions and you know they've they've taken it into their own hands and um he's a monster and it's hard to <laughs> argue with with their logic I, i'm interested to see how people how how what people decide yeah. when they're watching it. I, I'm interested to see at what point they come on board and 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 if they stay on board and 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 uh, you know, I mean, it's it's kind of up to you guys. It's up to the to the I think viewers. There's so much fun in watching Marley and Biggie's characters, though. You know, I think that's where all the the juicy fun yeah. and enjoyment that comes uh, you know alive in the show. And I think I'd be really surprised. But listen, who, who knows? But if people don't just respond to to, to that, you know, I, I don't. I would be more surprised if they had any sort of issue with that. Yeah. You know, I, th I think that that's where a lot of the comedy lies. So, yeah, and I think exactly. that, that get, getting that balance in the show, I think is a really tricky thing, but it's that's why the writing's so, so sharp and brilliant is because Sharon is able to strike that balance between having um, comedy, pathos, authentic, original characters that are rooted in truth, but are doing these kind of crazy things but at all you know you sort of you get pulled into it very very quickly and and you and you, they're believable you know and I think I think that's yeah that that, that, that balance and tone I, is what I, makes I it feel quite so. I hope so I mean the the thing is 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 the the original uh, is great and and we wouldn't have all come on board if it if it hadn't have been this amazing premise and you know um it's executed completely differently but I absolutely love the series but it had more of a slapstick kind of element there's, there's plenty of comedy in this show because 
the premise is is just inherently funny, but um, but the stakes are are really high, you know, across the board, and and there's there's fallout, and you know, they they get damaged by each attempt on him. It sort of you know um, chips, away. chips away at them mm. exactly, and and so I think when that is happening, you 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 feel you feel differently about it, you know. They're, they're not just fully gung-ho about taking yeah. a man's life. I mean, and if they are, it's just, it's very brief. And then it sort of yes. hits them. Now, uh, you know, it is quite clear that the show uh, will be an instant hit. Now, what do you think the success of this show, uh, the series, of course, you know, will do to you, both the stars as an actor, and will it also change the way you look at stories? Um, I don't know, change the way I look at stories. I mean, it's certainly when you're lucky enough to be cast in something that's as good as I think the show is and as great as the scripts are, you're, you're, you know, you kind of, <laughs> you sort of you strive to try and find another project that's going to, you know, be a, as good as that. And, the, you know, brilliant projects aren't always easy, easy to find mm -hmm. uh, or getting cast in them is yeah. not always <laughs> the easiest thing. Um, so it's, you know, it's, um, you know, one can only hope that you sort of come across more material like that. Um, as uh, regards to how it, it affects us as actors, I have no Not idea. Really. I don't really know. It's fine for me. I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. I just want people to really enjoy it. Yeah. I, I think the only thing I, I, I'd say is how, how it slightly affects how I think a story now is I, I started writing just a, a straight up kind of, you know, relationship y kind of uh, love story thing. And I, I was like, where's the murder? <laughs> it's just it's got a taste of murder it was, just, it was just strange having come from a thriller going yes. and, and that's what i'm used to writing is just mm. you know um you know observational kind of relationship or family or motherhood and so so i found myself thinking you know what do i do to sort of fill that mm -hmm. i'll get over it but you know what i mean it kind of got in in the way yeah. um a little yeah. bit <laughs> yes. <laughs> what was it about the script or what was it about Bad Sisters, you know, that made you uh, give it your nod? What made me want to do it? Um, oh, well, I, well, like I said, I mean, I, I think the, the scripts are brilliant. They're just they're brilliantly written. Um, all of the characters um, are multi-layered and complicated and have their real comic moments, but also are, have some sort of, you know, dile dilemma and crisis in their lives. So it's just... It, Everything was jumping off the page for, for me, and and when Sharon and I spoke about me playing Ursula, it was um, it just when you when you read dialogue like that, my first sort of desire is just to speak those lines. I just want to be able to speak those lines. So it was a bit of a no brainer, and I lucky enough to work with Sharon before, and it was just all. I mean, it was you know, it was a very easy yes. <laughs> so and Sarah, would you like to add anything to that? Yeah, I mean, I'm a huge fan of all these actresses so it was such a privilege <laughs> to come to work every day and watch them work like some yes. scenes were so intense yeah. and you were really yes. like, rooting for each other not just the character but as actresses and their performances and yeah it was a real honor to watch um some of the scenes especially in the later episodes um yeah. Yeah. oh yeah we uh, and it was it was lovely how supportive everyone was of everyone's performances like it was such a nice thing to be on set and just um have that you know um just someone going on that yeah. you know yeah, well done. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was yeah, really support. lovely yeah right yeah. my time is up thank you so much uh for thank your you. time and we're going to be recommending bad sisters to all of you thank, thank you. you thanks divya